Hey guys, it is day six of our Advent reading plan. And this starts the section of Christ is here. This will take us through day six through 13. So day six starts us out in the book of Luke, my favorite. Uh, chapter 1, verses 26 through 33. It says, And in the sixth month the angel Gabriel was sent from God unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth, to a virgin espoused to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David, and the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came in unto her and said, Hail, thou that art highly favored, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and cast in her mind what manner of salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God. And behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb, and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. He shall be great, and shall be called the Son of the Highest. And the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father David. And he shall reign over the house of Jacob forever, and his kingdom there shall be no end. And our notes at the bottom, 1, 26 through 33. Gabriel's announcement to Mary is significant for many reasons, including the declaration that Jesus will be the Messiah who will fulfill God's promise to David to King David. This promise is recorded in 2 Samuel chapter 7, particularly in verses 10 through 16. Nathan's prophecy from God was that King David's family, of which Jesus would be a descendant, would rule forever. It is day six, um, and today I'm thankful for God's word. I'm thankful for this Bible. It is an instruction manual for life. It tells me when I'm doing wrong. It gives me peace and comfort. God does these things, but he gives us words through this Bible. It gives me hope and joy. That is day six of our Advent reading and our days of thankfulness. Um, I will be back tomorrow with day seven. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you're not already. I love each and every one of you, and I'll see you tomorrow.